Greetings! Welcome to Daika's Car Toy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have another beautiful day, another blessed day, and I just want to say thank you so much for watching, and thank you for your time. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have another beautiful Daika's Car Toy that we're gonna unbox today, and I want to share it with you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's do this! <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, before we're gonna do unboxing, I just want to uh, show you this one. This one is a RX7 <laughs> Mazda. Uh, this one was being given to me by my son. Thank you so much, uh, JC, for giving me this one actually this one is the replica of his car that what he's driving or what he got uh, so this one uh, he gave to me for a Father's Day gift thank you so much and I just received it from the mail yesterday RX7 you know this RX7 is a special vehicle because this is the only vehicle was being it was being imported in United States that rotary engine rotary engine is a you know not everybody is familiar about rotary engine so this one is uh, like a triangle that there's no piston on it that's the that's the easy way to mention there you go and this one is 1982 let me see if i'm at wrong Yep, it's 1982 model, same of his car. Same color, same everything. So, I'll show it to you. Before I'm gonna go on my regular program unboxing. Okay. Okay. Now, we're gonna go to my unboxing today. Beautiful. This one is 1952 Volkswagen Beetle Deluxe model. The scale is 124. That's the scale of this big. So make it up. This should go. Uh, Volkswagen. I uh, stink small. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I don't know. I want to think me. <laughs> Okay, nice box and everything presentable. Nice, uh, uh, if you can see, there's a big emblem in the behind on it a Volkswagen sign over here. Volkswagen 1952 Volkswagen, and we're gonna do unboxing on this beautiful big. Okay, where is it? There you go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Um, I want to invite you to to watch the second part of the video, the it's turn table time of this beautiful bagel. On our on topic on it's turn table time, we're gonna talk about a little bit history of this bagel. And sometimes I miss some uh, detail when I'm doing unboxing, so I'm trying to uh, point them out at the same time. Long time ago, uh, my uncle sold me a 1974 Volkswagen Beetle, Super Beetle. But sad part on that time is I'm in not in financially condition and I cannot maintain the vehicle. That's why I lost it. But you know, it is what it is. There you go. This is the think small. Please think big, not small. <laughs> okay. So on the side. And this particular vehicle, you know, they have a... I like this one is because of the... He got the platform. is beautiful. Okay, let me get my special tool. Mm. Oh, there. Oh, I'm losing my special tools. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> okay, I hope I got I got the right one. Oh, before I gonna, there she is. Before I gonna remove him, 
or hair in the platform. Okay. Nice color, red. Oh, I need to wear my bam my <laughs> magnifying glasses. Or oh, else I won't see the screw because the screw is too small. Uh I need I need the plus, the pilip. There you go, the pilip, not the minus. So, there you go. Make sure you got the right size, or else, because this this kind of screw are easy screw head screw to a uh, screw head. <laughs> it's with a strip. If you strip it. Uh oh, that's a big problem. Now you're having a problem how to take them off. So always be gentle with them. And I just want to mention again, thank you so much, uh, son, for your gift from the Father's Day. And to my daughter, daughters, my sons, my daughters, uh, thank you so much for the greets. And love. There you go. Come on. Still hook. Still connected. Take them off. Take them off totally because it won't budge. Let's see. Why? Oh, there you go. I need to move the the thingy over here. There you go. Let's just put this one on the side. And let me put this one in the side. I don't want to lose the screw. There you go. Okay. So, 1952 Volkswagen. Okay, now we need the special scissor our special tools okay this one can close from now for now oh you know what? i'm not done doing that. there's another plat platform that i forgot to need to take it off i thought i'm done already screwing <laughs> screwing oh my god okay uh, anyway, uh, happy, happy, happy Saturday, everyone. I hope everybody gonna have a nice, good, quiet, enjoyable weekend. Uh, now is the summer. Started when? Friday or Thursday? They said. So, if you're working outdoor like me, please uh, don't forget to get your... Uh, your cooling period you know if you feel hot warm you know it's your right to get a cooling period at the same time please drink a lot of fluids okay let's cut this one there you go and to avoid any uh, overheating and always be careful out there Heat is not, uh, you know, that's our uh, thing if you're working outdoor, heat and cold. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. She's pretty, huh? Beautiful. Nicey, nicey. 1952 Super Deluxe Volkswagen model. Okay. I forgot to mention earlier. In the platform, if you're going to notice, there's some... Uh, Numbers over there. Go, I'll put this one over there, over here. Uh, I'm assuming that's the when it made. Uh, 2021. Um, I think August 2021. This vehicle was being made by this company. So 2021. That's a few years ago. 21, 22, 23, and 4. No. We're 24 now. No, only 23. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I'm taking my time. Okay, if you're gonna see in the front, ladies and gentlemen, that's bumper. 
You see the bumper, the distance from the bumper from the body? Wow, is that really the design of uh, 1952 Volkswagen? Because mine, uh, my 1974 Volkswagen, I have a bumper shock. And this one is total uh, metal. 1974. Oh, 1970. 1952. I'm getting confused now. Beautiful. Okay. There's a bumper. Uh, if you can see. What's, is that the emblem? Emblem is different. See that? Okay. I'm going to picture it. But you got your hood latch over there. And, you know, this the trim of Volkswagen. Like a chrome in the middle. And you're going to see end up. In the top box wagon and you can see the headlights beautiful simple but elegant the color shiny red and at the same time in the windshield you can see the windshield wiper is very visible that's nice that the, they change the color like they put silver on it and at the same time you can open the trunk okay nice in the in the front of the trunk you can see I, want, I cannot open high enough. I don't know. I think this one is a radiator or something. I know this one is air cool, but there's a cup over there. Oh, probably for the windshield wiper washer, maybe. I'm assuming. Um, you you got your spare tire, another protection just in case you hit something, and there's another like a. I don't know. That one is. For the air or for turn signal light, see that like round thing over underneath the of the headlights. Then I'm mentioning again, please always be careful about the side mirror. If this one is exposed, like you did not put it uh, in the case again or in the special box, uh, you're gonna lose that first that side mirror because that one is very delicate. It's only a plastic one, if you can see. But, you know, you can see the trim, the door latch over there, or you have to open the door. There you go. Beautiful chrome. The tire are rubber. Nice chrome of the rim. And we can open this door. I believe. Oh, yep. We can open the door. There you go. And you can see the detail. Usually, Volkswagen is a stick ship. If you can see, you can see the shifting gear in the center console. Then the steering wheel, and of course, you can see the three pedal, the accelerator, the, oh, that's nice that they put a little bit of shiny color on those, uh, those uh, uh, pedal, the accelerator, the brake, and at the same time, the clutch. And nice dashboard, they put the different color in the dashboard, almost you can see that the speedometer over there. Okay, beautiful. And in the nice of this one, ladies and gentlemen, in 1952, this one is a split window in the back. If you can see that split window, beautiful. And you can open this engine compartment. If you can see the detail of this engine compartment, you can see even the serpentine belt in there. The serpentine belt is right there, that one. Yep, that uh, hook up with the alternator. I believe, yeah, alternator. Beautiful, detailed, nice. Then you can see the tail light, the bumper, and of course the license plate 1952. And they put nice, beautiful, you know, the light for the license plate and shiny, nice, nice. I love it, I love it. In the passenger side, simple, same thing. The on the driver side, only the difference. There's no side mirror, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Beautiful, nicey, nicey. I love it. I love it. There's a running chrome over here. Nice. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. You know what, ladies and gentlemen? I don't see the gasoline uh, thingy over here. Probably the gasoline is in the front of the cab. Oh, front of the vehicle. Maybe. I'm not sure because I never see... Uh, uh, 1952 Volkswagen uh, closely maybe I see them in the road but closely looking them out you know. let's open the 
if you have a comment please leave a comment about that ah, beautiful okay so detailed everything the nice one in this they put tinted in the if you're gonna notice it's tinted the windows and the rear split window in the back nice that's the uh, passenger side you can see the steering wheel and everything and you know what ladies and gentlemen boys and girls this one is operational steering wheel that if you're gonna turn the steering wheel the wheel gonna turn I believe there beautiful you see you can see that nice nice okay oh nice I can feel the force and underneath we have a small diagram over here, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. So, because Volkswagen is, um, the old Volkswagen is a rear drive. <coughs> so, okay. This one is reverse, I think. Okay. The engine over here. Probably this one is the differential. Then you have running something over here. Because your shifting gear is here so probably your transmission there's a cable running from here going over there to the differential to the oh to the transmission so yeah i said i have a Volkswagen before but i'm not really on that time i'm still uh, learning about bagel i'm not sure <laughs> but i lost the bagel actually okay okay nice and beautiful okay you know what is next ladies and gentlemen it's rod test this beautiful vehicle gonna roll trolling okay the, the wheel is not straight <laughs> oh okay okay we have a little bit problem gonna it's not rolling it's not rolling. We have a small discrepancy over here, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. One of our rear tire to the uh, driver side is not functional properly. You know, if you can see, it's hitting the body. See, it's like oblong. <laughs> but you know what? Let me probably I can fix this one. Let's see. Because I think it came off from the came off from the rim. Turn it there. Okay, still oblong, but I think gonna roll better. It's not. It's in the rim now. Yep. It's much better now but it's not rolling it's supposed to be what it's doing you know it's uh it's all right it is what it is but you know it's nice it's nice uh piece uh decoration and it's beautiful but the detail and everything i'm impressed okay ladies and gentlemen boys and girls it fell in the rolling it's not rolling <laughs> okay ladies and gentlemen boys and girls thank you for watching thank you for your time and if you're new on my program please subscribe at the same time uh, hit notification bell so every time we're gonna do a uh, we're gonna post a new video you're gonna be notified and i'm always reminding everybody please 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 if you're gonna ride, always be defensive. Bye.